हेलो स्टूडेंट्स मोस्ट वेलकम आपकी अपनी वाइपी कंप्यूटर क्लासेस की टू क्रिएटिव लर्निंग में इन दिस वीडियो वी विल डिस्कस आउटपुट क्वेश्चंस तो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस एट आउटपुट क्वेश्चंस दीज आर थ्री क्वेश्चंस एंड इन सेकंड पिक्चर वी हैव दीज एट टोटल नंबर ऑफ एट आउटपुट क्वेश्चन वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस व्हिच इज रिलेटेड टू चैप्टर लाइब्रेरी क्लासेस चैप्टर I am just telling you source where these uh, programs comes from. Chapter library classes, okay. And uh, book is what's a book name? Book A P C Understanding Computer Application. And this is chapter two, okay. Name is library classes. Then start one by one. Just we take this picture. Now first question. Care C H is equal to asterisk. Boolean B is equal to character dot is letter. Is letter function is used to check given character is letter or not. So is this letter? No. That's why inside B what will come? False. So here answer becomes false. Okay. first uh, first question is done now question number 2 c is equal to a in single quote okay and uh, int c what's the meaning of it int c it will convert it into ascii code okay it means we need to know what is ascii code okay characters and uh, their ascii code a s c double i okay Do you know these codes? Capital A to Z, sixty-five to ninety. Small A to Z, ninety-seven to one twenty-two. Zero to nine, forty-eight to fifty-seven. For this chapter, you need to learn these all ASCII code because we need these all ASCII code. Okay. Then C is capital A. Capital A ASCII code is what? Sixty-five. Sixty-five plus thirty-two. This is thirty-two, which is ninety-seven, right? And ninety-seven is related to small a. So answer becomes small a. So this is the output of question number two, a, and Answer of one, question one, false, and question two, A. Okay. Now, third question. I'll just erase all things. I just write the answer only. This is uh, false. Now it is A. Okay. Now question number three. S is equal to seven in double quotes. Okay. And integer dot parse int method convert s into integer. Okay, in t you will get seven, but in the form of integer. In s also you have seven, but in the form of string. So with s you can't do any calculation, but in t you can do calculation. T plus one thousand, मतलब seven plus one thousand. So answer will be. One zero zero seven, one thousand seven. Answer will come. Okay. Now, yeah. So, its answer is false. Its answer is A, and its answer is seven. One zero zero seven, not seven only. One zero zero seven. Okay. Now, come to second picture. Now, question number four. Again, C is equal to B. Okay, and I is equal to four. C plus I. How can you solve it? I is four and C is B. We can't uh, plus B as a directly. So what's the ASCII code of B? It is sixty six. Sixty six plus four. What will come here? Sixty six plus four. It's seventy, right? So its answer is seventy. And here. It is uh, convert explicitly. 
here it is convert directly implicitly and here we are converting it to matlab like explicitly but meaning is same answer again 70 will come okay here also 66 plus 4 to so directly 77 okay i hope uh, this is uh, clear here 77 here also 77 both answer are 77 now question number 5 C H is equal to Y. Y is small letter, and it is converted into capital letter. In C H R, it is capital Y, and uh, capital Y will convert into P. Then uh, what will be the value of P? C H R. Okay, integer value of capital Y. Okay, C H R value of C H R is what? Capital Y now, okay. So we need a ASCII value for it. Now capital A to Z sixty five to ninety, and Y Z means it means value of Y becomes eighty nine, right? So just value of P is eighty nine, and the tab space will come between them. C H R is capital Y. So final outcome will be capital Y tab space in between and eighty nine. This is the result. Okay. Now question six n is equal to ninety seven character dot two upper case char n in C H what will come in C H This is ninety-seven means small a, and small a will convert it into upper case means capital A. In C H, what will come? Capital A, and uh, here capital A will print and the uh, big message, great victory. So final ans of uh, answer, a uh, great victory. Okay, so this is the answer for this question number six. Now question number seven. Now we solve question number seven. C H is equal to X. N is five. N plus C H. Okay. N is five plus C H. C H is X. So just X, Y, and Z. We know the value of Z. One twenty-two, right? Ninety-seven to. One twenty-two. As key code of small letters. So this is one twenty-one, and this becomes one twenty. Okay. This is a way to get uh, directly as key code from beginning A, B, C, D. If you count, it will take lots of time. You can go backward. So one twenty, you will get uh, value of X. One twenty. Okay. Here we can put one twenty. Then you will get one twenty five. Okay. Now int c, int c. Here, if you check, we are going to convert value of n into c as a character. N is one twenty five, and one twenty five character we don't know. Okay, and we are not printing here character. So don't take tension. Ha. Huh. If they print in SOP. Value of C, then it becomes tension because we don't know the character of 125 as the value. Okay, because 65 to 90 we know, 97, 97 to 122 we know, 48 to 57, and rest of we don't know. Okay, and we need to get from the Google. So no need in this question. Okay, they don't give out of these things, and then one twenty five minus twenty six, it is ninety nine, and ninety nine converted into cat, so you will get only C. So answer of question seven is C, small C. Okay, output is C only. Now question eight. C H is equal to A means 
as the value of ch 65 now it converted into lower case chr in chr you will get small a in ch you will, uh, you have small uh, capital a and uh, small a means 97 minus 32 it will be 65 okay so n is 65 that is uh, again converted to <laughs> capital so its answer is a slash t and chr is small a so final answer of question 8 is a tab space and a this is the result okay hmm. now okay again my suggestion is for this question because in n we get 125 so we don't know the character value of 125 and we are not going to print here okay so don't panic that's why they subtract 26 okay so answer is only c here ha huh. if they print this c then it becomes tension so it won't come like uh, in exam like this okay so don't panic now these are the output questions thank you very much thank you for watching this video